Hey yo, what up guys? So in this video, we're going to be talking about Bella Smuda, Bella Smuda, Olamide and guys, the news that is going around on autopsy and what the nurses have come out to say guys. Omo, this is getting really crazy and the police in fact has given a statement and they were like, they are just trying to say generally that everybody should let the police do their work and guys, that's what we're doing here. We're allowing the police do their work, you understand? Because nothing will give us more joy than you know coming out and having great justice for mobad guys we want to see justice for mobad and guys the police are doing their work already guys so guys you know it was said that you know bella smuda was the closest friend to mobad and we have even seen proof about that we have seen videos upon videos of bella smuda and mobad guys so in fact we also know that when mobad died bella smuda was not in the country so this guy got to hear the gist when he was out out of the country like two days he traveled he was called and they told him guys like mo was actually dead and in fact we know that this thing really touched bella like this thing really touched bella crazy he, in fact he has not been looking himself recently so he finally came out to give his final tribute and this was how it played out to be as you about we see ah uh, with and if you were so far away. and um this person is my brother is my guy is, you know is my best friend and um it's so sad um, when I left Nigeria, like two days, three days later, I got a call that Yo, Mubad is dead. It was so funny. You understand? Even my mom had to call me that Bella, my team, Wale, what should I do? What I do? But you understand? I understand what she's saying. And um, I like Mubad. God bless you wherever you are, even in your grave. Um, I don't know what to say. Just thank you, everybody, for coming. And justice for Mubad. So big shout out to Bella for this, you know, to get the confidence to really come out and pay his tribute, guys. I really liked what Bella did, you know, he did not make noise, he did not come out, you know, to with the crowd. He just came out with some few people, you understand, to do his own tribute, to make his tribute really special. So big shout out to Bella for this one. Then also, guys, there is a clip actually, you know, surfacing online. There is this clip surfacing online. And this clip is sounding exactly like Olamide, but this thing was not posted in Olamide's office official page like i did not see it on olamide's official page guys and it's a tribute to mobad guys so i'm just going to be playing it for you i'm going to be playing part for you and you tell me what you think about it guys if you think this is olamide happy mobad everybody mock mobad i still never understand if it's part of the plan i'm a llama buckle up i'm a llama tech bama any opportunity i'm a llama larry more so many pains to check me anymore But to me the real way about me being bullet law Shit hit different when I heard about this I'm a jab on the dreamy while I saw about this Sarah to call it a piano, you niggas done this I've got the choke case of a deer at six feet I'm back to back, but she back to send down I share with your car, but I'm very member Cause it's not a bad, you that's why you never put down If you keep by the sword, you know you die by the sword and if it's Olamide, it's actually very good, you understand? Because we all know how Olamide is in the industry, guys. Olamide is a man with a big heart. So big shout out to Olamide if it's actually Olamide, guys. Which I can't confirm because it was not gotten from his main page. It was just gotten online. I just saw it online and a lot of people were saying Olamide. It sounded like Olamide, though. But since it was not gotten from his main page, then I was becoming doubtful if it was actually Olamide. Then, guys, right now, you know, right now, investigation investigations are still going on and right now the national association of nigerian nurses and midwife they have come out you know to put out a statement guys so they have come out to put out a statement and the statements really read something like this they came out to put out a statement you know relating to mobad's death and the statement went like this they were like the national association of nigerian nurses and midwives which is the nannm lagos state council expresses its deepest condolence to the family and associate of the late musician Ilari Oluwa Aloba, popularly known as Mobad, during this difficult time. Our thoughts and prayers are with them as we mourn his tragic passing. Then they went on to say, we fully support the ongoing investigation into the circumstances surrounding his death and urge the relevant authorities to take no stone unturned in the pursuit of justice for him. However, we must stress the importance of professionalism in reporting and conducting this investigation investigation. NANMM is closely monitoring the situation with keen interest. Our preliminary investigations indicate that 
the individual reportedly taken into custody by the police for providing care to Mubad is not a registered nurse. We emphasize the critical need to verify the qualifications and professional status of individuals before labeling them a healthcare professional. It is regrettable that the Nigerian's healthcare system faces significant regulatory challenges, leading to the presence of unqualified individuals performing medical roles that they are not trained for. In Nigeria, to be recognized as a nurse, one must complete a rigorous five-year Bachelor of Nursing Science program at a university, additional year of internship. Alternatively, one can undergo training at an, at an accredited college of nursing and become registered and licensed by the Nursing and Midwife Council of Nigeria. We wish to clarify that the term auxiliary nurse has no place within Nigeria's healthcare system or its laws. An individual is either a qualified nurse or an unqualified individual performing tax beyond their competence. Furthermore, we call on the investigating authorities and the media to exercise caution and accuracy in their reporting during the investigation. We will not tolerate any misinterpretation of nurses and the nursing profession. We demand that all media outlets that inaccurately reported the arrest of a nurse take immediate corrective action to rectify their stories. Once again, we extend our deepest condolence to the family, friends, and fans of Mobad. We pray for the strength to endure his irreplaceable loss. Um, so that's what all these people came out to say. Like this is the statement they actually came out to say. And it's actually crazy because they are trying to say now, you know, that the person that administered the drug to Mobad or the injection to Mobad is not a registered nurse. And this is what is happening right now, guys. Anyway, very black man had what to say about this. And just listen. And guys, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. All right. Sure you can see they said the nurse national association of nurses said the nurse that gave mobad a tetanus injection is a quack nurse and this is why i said those three boys that announced that mobad is dead they have questions to answer first of all who took him there to that nurse secondly immediately after she gave him the injection did he die immediately or did he die hours later or minutes later because in the video where those boys are showing mobad is dead mobad is dead mobad head moved and immediately his head moved like this they entered the video the question is who is the nurse working for and who are these boys that took him there working for who are they working for do you understand because you know if you carry celebrity but you go they give quack nurse person where get money there's a lot of big big hospitals where you will take them to so who is the nurse working for and who are these guys working for now this particular guy especially the one on dread i is still the one in the video where mobad went to go and buy a range rover that means this boy is close to mobad to an extent do you understand so immediately after mobad raised his head they ended that video what happened when they ended that video and secondly who is the nurse working for and who are these boys working for I asked this question, all of them, they face one direction, Neramali and Samnari. I said whether or not Neramali and Samnari actually did something on this case, they have to still be charged and their music needs to be cancelled and Malians need to be cancelled. My reason is because they bullied that boy to depression and to a point where the boy was also a danger to himself. Do you understand? And then see the story I'm hearing of DJ, Pla DJ Splash. That one will break my heart anytime I see that boy picture, I swear to God. And then also, a lot of things that they are accusing the Malians for. Do you understand? I asked this question. And then again, to the precious one where nobody will make anybody talk about, I said the wife. Because of the recording I had, I said they should also investigate the wife. Do you understand? I've been asking all these questions. People neglect me and talk about DNA. And then from the DNA part, the sister of Mubad wife said, if I talk about DNA again, she's going to slam me a lawsuit of 300 million. Um, that what right do I have to ask for DNA? This is the right I have. The account number you people posted online for the general public to contribute, I contributed 100 Naira. And then that 100 Naira gave me the right to ask if where my money is going to is authentic. Do you understand? And I believe a lot of people in the general public also care to know where their money is going to. So if you want to sue me 300 million, you are a joker because my contribution is there. And guess what? You cannot return my 100 Naira again. So my 100 Naira is standing strong in that account. Do you understand? So bring your lawyers when you are ready. Now, my question is, that quack nurse, why did those boys take that guy to the quack nurse? Do you understand? Because he's a rich boy, they could afford any hospital in Nigeria. Why did they take him to the quack nurse? Who is the quack nurse working for? Do you understand? And immediately after the video, did Mobad die immediately after they inject him or did he die after that video? That is the question.
I beg to the people in charge of the case. I appreciate what you people are doing so far. Shout out to you guys. But please relate all the, if you watch my video, please don't take because of, okay. Um, you people are offended because of DNA, you understand, and not and not take my own this thing. I see a lot of people saying, Why can't I also go there? My brother, I get court case. I know if you come out from Abuja like this, if you call me for court anytime, do you understand? Me, I'll be personally say, Okay, I'll be, I feel work I need it. I go, I'll be, I'll be forced. You see what I do in Love Dark? I'll be forced. Don't play. I know be cloud chaser. I know they do one for clouds because I care. You understand? We will get justice. Don't play. Don't play.